welcome American truckers to trucking with old snapper and of course I'm old snapper no podcast I got here uh, we talk about trucking and everything trucking related anyway trying out this Yeti mic I feel like I've used so many mics over the last uh, week or so that I could start doing mic reviews you know but I'm using a Yeti mic on my uh, HP stream the HP stream doesn't have a very good camera but it works it works anyway <coughs> I got this mic on podcast setting so that I need to get close to it and hopefully it uh if I cough because I smoke a pack and a half a day I can turn my head and it won't blow anybody's ears out there listening in YouTube land but anyway, I want to talk about these speeding cameras. Uh, for the most part, they're in construction zones. Uh, heard from a couple drivers. One of them actually watches this channel. Um, that uh, he got one in Tennessee. And he's not on YouTube a lot, but I'm sure when he sees this video, he'll comment below and let all the other drivers know where he got his ticket at. But uh, this is becoming more and more common you know uh, more and more of these states are going to cameras since they're cutting back on the number of law enforcement that they actually use out on the roads uh, some of these states have done budget cuts you know and defunded the police a little bit and because of that they've gone to using cameras well as y'all know defunding the police doesn't mean there's not going to be any police it just changes the way that our government uh, goes about uh catching us right <laughs> by the way I found this hat in Walmart I don't know who that character is if one of y'all know who it is please hit me up let me know I don't know who it is but I like the character the way it looked I thought it fit my personality you know so but anyway I did some research on these uh, red light cameras or not red light cameras but speed cameras so far there are 16 states currently that are using these uh, speed cameras in some fashion like I said most of them are in road construction okay um, I tried to get a number to gather how many tickets they're writing and I couldn't find anything definitive when I was doing my research but I was able to find Maryland reported in 2019 which is a couple years ago but in 2019 Maryland reported they earned 64 million just from speed cameras alone nothing else just from speed cameras that's wild drivers and this affects all drivers whether you drive a car a truck or a really fast bicycle you know this this affects all of us but anyway um, I tried to also gather a number on exactly what the uh, parameters are because I'm sure they're not writing tickets to drivers that you know um, get caught one mile per hour over right that wouldn't make no sense but I couldn't find anything it was such a broad spectrum it depends on the state it depends on whether it's a road construction area or a regular speeding camera okay but it can be anywhere from four mile an hour over to 12 mile an hour over different states are were registered differently I'm gonna put down in the description below uh, some of the links to these different places where I got this research from so y'all can go check it out and you can see for yourself if there's certain states that you travel in on a normal basis be a good idea to go look at the list and see you know how uh, how strict they are on these uh, road construction areas especially I know uh, the guy that watches this channel the ticket he got from one of these speeding cameras was in road construction in uh, Tennessee so need to keep be careful and keep that in mind uh, let me know what y'all think of this Yeti mic. You know, uh, 
pretty expensive mic, but in my headphones it sounds good. So we'll see what it's like once I get it all uploaded, get everything done there. Uh, and I'm sure somebody will email me about my hat. I think it's a cartoon character. Uh, one of the other drivers was telling me that uh, he uh, thought it was a Disney character, but I don't know, but I kind of like it. And it's got the flat bill, you know, so works with my glasses. But anyway, I'm over here in Missouri. I'm going to be delivering either tomorrow or the next day. I'm going to try to get it in there tomorrow. I'm chasing hours, so no telling. I got till uh, the 4th to get it in there. But I'm headed up to the Chicago area at the current time. Uh, I am working on a group chat, putting a group chat together, especially for some of the guys that... Uh, want to want to get in there want to want to talk about sobriety and uh different things like that but it's going to be trucking and trucking related and uh i'll designate a time a couple hours a week that i'm in that group chat and active you know so i can answer questions or whatever for whoever has questions or whatever out there hope all y'all are staying safe staying out of trouble don't forget, if you see old snapper, man, hit me up. That's my CB handle. Uh, I answer to just about anything, <laughs> you know, so. And I got a sticker on the side of my truck that says American Truckers. So, and it's the same one that you see in the intro to this video. So, if you see it, holler at me on the radio, say what's up. Be good to hear from you. Y'all take care. Stay safe. Don't be getting no tickets in these uh, road construction areas or uh, around the country. We used to have a saying out here long ago, don't feed the bears. All right, drivers, let's don't feed the bears. I appreciate all y'all for watching. Appreciate all the new subscribers out there. Welcome to the channel. <laughs>